Hi, I'm Yasmin Hussein, and welcome to this week's Motoring News. Mini has revealed its latest John Cooper Works paceman. The mildly facelifted model features a restyled hexagonal grille, new lightweight alloys and optional LED fog lamps with integrated daytime running lights. The four-wheel drive JCW paceman comes with a choice of two petrol and two diesel engines, offering up to 218 bhp for a 0-62 time of 6.8 seconds and a top speed of 142 miles per hour. All mini pacemans now include rain-sensing wipers and automatic climate control as standard, with prices starting at just under £30,000. Tour de France favourite Chris Froome has become the first person ever to cycle from the UK to France under the sea. And as official vehicle supplier for Team Sky, Jaguar was there to support the 2013 winner as he cycled the 32 miles through the Eurotunnel. Froome was accompanied by a fleet of all-new XF Sport brakes as he rode through the tunnel at a training pace, completing the world's first subsea cycle crossing in approximately 55 minutes, reaching speeds of up to 40 miles per hour. Vauxhall has confirmed it will take on 550 new workers in the UK as its business continues to expand with another new model on the horizon. The Ellesmere Port plant in Cheshire is to offer 300 new jobs to support the arrival of the all-new 2015 Astra, while the van facility in Luton will be bolstered by the arrival of 250 new employees to increase output of the recently launched Vivaro van. Vauxhall says the new jobs are to be phased in over the first quarter of next year. A beefed-up version of the Chevrolet Camaro is returning to the silver screens as Bumblebee for the latest in the hugely successful Transformers movie franchise. Director Michael Bay asked General Motors to redesign the popular character, giving him a more aggressive and muscular look. The result is the Camaro TF4 concept, which stars alongside Mark Warburg and Nicola Peltz, as well as Crosshairs, an Autobot power trooper who transforms into a green Corvette Stingray. Transformers 4 Age of Extinction is in cinemas now. French specialist car maker Exagon Motors has confirmed its futuristic Furtive EGT sports car will be on display at London's Salute to Style show. The four-seater coupe, which features an F1-style carbon fibre honeycomb monocoque chassis, is powered by two electric motors, each developing over 400 bhp, delivering a 0-62 time of just 3.5 seconds. The Salute to Style show takes place at the Hurlingham Club from the 17th to 19th of July. Jeep has brought its Territory Tour off-road course to London's Olympic Park in Stratford. Designed to demonstrate the capabilities of the all-new Cherokee, the setup includes steep climbs, axle twists and a huge balancing seesaw ramp. The tour offers enthusiasts and potential customers the chance to try off-road adventure-style driving without having to leave town. Available now, the Jeep Cherokee is powered by a 170 bhp 2-litre multi-jet turbo diesel engine mated to a 9-speed automatic gearbox. Prices start from £25,495 on the road. That's all we've got time for, but we'll have more motoring news next week.